it's amazing to see how many Christian leaders have, have not just tolerated the Big Bang idea, but they've embraced it wholeheartedly. They've made it a part of, the, a part of creation, part of theology. Uh, to hear their pronouncements is like believers should welcome it as a major plank in our defense of the faith. Uh, sort of, at last, we can use science to prove that there's a creator for the universe. But there's a heavy price to pay for surrendering to the temptation of secular acceptability, at least in physics and astronomy. As a ministry, we have warned for a long time that adopting the Big Bang into Christian thought is like bringing the wooden horse within the walls of Troy for a number of reasons. The Big Bang forces acceptance of a sequence of events totally incompatible with the Bible. For example, the earth after the sun instead of earth before sun. That's right. That's backwards. Uh, number two, the Big Bang's billions of years of astronomical evolution are not only based on naturalistic assumptions, they're contrary to the words of Jesus himself, who said that people were there right from the beginning, not towards the end of an incredibly long creation so-called process. That's right. Number three, the slow evolution of the stars, then the solar system and the planets, including Earth, in Big Bang thinking means that Big Bang Christians are also going to have to accept geological evolution. Millions of years for the Earth's fossil-bearing rocks to be laid down. So they end up denying the global flood and accepting death and uh, bloodshed and disease as seen in the fossils before Adam. This removes the fall and the curse on creation from any effect on the real world. And it also removes the biblical answer that Christians have always had to the problem of suffering and evil. God made a perfect world ruined by sin. Yeah, and that's huge. Uh, And and lastly, marrying one's theology to today's science, so-called science, means that one is likely to be widowed tomorrow. Um, If if you hang your hat, your theological hat, on the Big Bang because the majority believes it, you'll be embarrassed when it fails. Instead, let's trust in the one who made it all. His words are truth and life 